What's up, guys? And welcome back to Need for Speed Unbound. I woke up early for the first video at 2 in the morning and I ended up falling asleep while it was rendering and I ended up just posting the video three hours later than I was or could have posted it. So that was very uh, pointless. So welcome back. Uh, we have been betrayed. If you watched the first episode, the intro to this story, holy cow, we have been very betrayed and we are now doing deliveries for Rydell's garage which is basically where we work and maybe live I'm not sure yet but I would like to see a little bit more cutscenes in this one we recorded for about an hour and a half on the last episode and we probably got like two or three cutscenes max maybe two but the last one there was very very intriguing and uh kind of unexpected but uh sit back relax and let's do this hey name's Jess Heard you might be a good person to call for a cheap ride. I'll hit you with the address on where I'm heading. No sweat. Be there soon. Recording at 2 a.m. is just not for me. I, I was like, man, I was so tired. But I did do something interesting. I kind of did like half face cam, half gameplay. I I'm still not sure um, if I wanted to do just gameplay only for this video. I do recall in my previous Need for Speed Heat series, which was like two, three years ago, I did see a couple of comments saying that it'd be nice to just have the gameplay because it is a racing game. It's not technically like a story, even though there is story elements to this. Um, so that's why I kind of went that route, but uh, I'll see how that video performs and how you guys like that and we'll, we'll take it from there. I really like how the uh the animation of the characters looks inside the vehicles i think it's so cool it's a trip to be honest kind of weird to get used to but pretty cool <laughs> yeah i was like yo bro and yo check this bro he was all like if you know you know bro and you know what I said? <laughs> Bro! Yeah, hi. Um, Tess? Yo! Yo, I'm running a little late, so if you could, uh, you know. I got you. What? Do you have a pet chinchilla or like a. a possum or something? Um, <laughs> no. <laughs> Why? Really? No reason. I'm just gonna crack this window. So, Sorry. What's this address? Headed to this empty lot off the underpass. You know it? That was an old meetup spot for local street racers. Oh, you race? Or something like that. Anyways, cops have that spot pretty locked down now. <laughs> the scene's about to get a big shakeup from what I hear. Wait, really? Mm-hmm. If you know, you know. And I know, bro. So what's up? You're in the racing scene, but you don't have a car? Real G's get rides. I also like being on time. Yo, does this thing go any faster? Real G's get rides. It's sorry about the smell, you know. Besides the fact that I slightly farted, yeah, we do have a possum problem. Five stars. Great conversation. Hey, you should stick around. Might be worth your while. Oh, yeah, thanks for the advice. I crashed on purpose. I don't like her attitude, damn it. Alright, we're going up against different cars. Seems like a lot of the same people. Or at least that cha cha guy. Dude gave me nightmares. Almost beat me a couple of times. Ooh. Rydell's Express. Cheap and fast at your service. Whoa. I have not seen this many racers in one place in a minute. Brought everyone back out. The love of racing, bruh. The need to express oneself behind the wheel. And money also. Yeah, probably money. I forgot how much I missed this. <laughs> I can see why. <clears throat> I'm gonna do the rounds, figure out what's up. Thanks for the lift, Speedy. Oh, hell no! Nah. That's my car. Yes? All right, all right, focus up. Let's go. 
I'm to knock her out. I'm glad showed up. How many years has it been, for real? The man cracks down a little bit and we all bitch out? I thought this was Lakeshore. I thought this was a racing scene. Flex in with your super tuners and your muscle cars. That guy. Woo. What's it gonna take, huh, to remind you why we got into this? Stacks. Cha ching <clears throat> I see what's happening. Three qualifiers, high risk. You have a run in with the cops, you take them on. You make it, and I will see you in the finals. The Lakeshore Grand. You wanna win? Then you had better be the best. <clears throat> now everybody run from the cops. <laughs> Seven days into the first qualifier. Earn your place. Yes. Yo, Speedy. You still want that five star rating? Then show me what you got. Five stars? I got you. She can clearly see me. The fact that she didn't she didn't even acknowledge us. Is the of the wow. Dispatch, we're pursuing suspects. Is the sound of the police? All right. I don't remember the name of that song, but if you've heard it, let me know down below. Oh, shit. All right. Damn pigs want to play rough. Huh? All due respect to all the great cops out there. I'm just in my zone right now. I don't mean to call you a pig. So if you see this and you, you are a cop, I'm sorry. I'm just, you know. Let's just head over there. Hey, this. Oh, God. Thank goodness. Sure that, that was a tactic. You see, I lost them. See that? That was a strategy. Here we go. Well, I wanted to lose them to get the money for that, but. Whatever. I missed it by a little inch. But we're back at the garage, and we've got something to talk about now, right? This is it. Ride those rides. Not bad. I think could use a little work. <laughs> so, this is where Yaz started off, huh? Seems like she's gonna be our girl now. Get the hell out of my shop! Wasn't me! Whoa, <laughs> whoa. Kid, you triggered the alarm system. Hey, no touching. <laughs> Sorry, this is Tess. I almost took your hair off. Nice to meet you, Slugger. Right on. I saw Jasmine. She just rolled up at this meetup. You're kidding. She still had the car. And she's still with that same crew that jacked our garage, setting up some high stakes circuit called the Lake Short Grand. <laughs> Corny. With our car. I need to beat her. I need the garage. I need your help. Slow down, kid. Now, let's say you do this, okay? And you throw down with Jasmine and you beat her in a street race. So what? So what? That's what this garage was about. Now look at this place. <clears throat> We're fine. This yours? Didn't I say no touch? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Rides of Rydell's Rides. Love that name, by the way. Full disclosure. I went to that meetup tonight looking for a racer. Then the cops showed up and I was like, the cops. <laughs> oh yeah. And the kid was crazy fast out running him. Now, I'm thinking, learn from the best. Listen, I got what you need, cash. And you two got what I want, a reason to win. How about I make an investment in this garage, rep you in the race, maybe open some doors. Come on, Rydell. I can win. We can bring this place back. Well, first things first, you got to turn on the lights, you know? I'm in. Woohoo! Just promise me, no matter what Jasmine does, you do it the right way. Deal? Deal. So, Rydell, got any rides out back? Welcome to Rydell's Rides. <laughs> <laughs> Man, 
Pokemon's been depressed for two years. Oh, so now we get to choose our first car, like our first official car, because the first car wasn't really our car. It was kind of a partnership. You know, we hooked it up with, with uh, Jasmine or whatnot. So this is our first car. This is a dealership. Use the cash from Taz. Buy on your ride before you head out. We've got $37,000. Oh, boy. Uh, What am I going to... Oh, you remember this one? Hold on. Where is it? This is the one we had over in uh, Need for Speed Heat. Oh, shit. Brings back memories. Oh, that's a good one. Ooh. Good old muscle. My dad used to have this eclipse when I was a kid. Good memories. Oof. 60,000. This is not the one that uh, ASAP Rocky has. Item is locked by custom. All right, hold on. Got a decent amount of interesting vehicles here. Oh, so this is the new. Uh, I was looking at this car. We had seen it earlier. This is a new 350 or 370. What are they calling it now? A Z prototype. Okay. I'll go. I'll. Yep. We'll go for it. Fuck it. That's a pretty cool car. I have some customers looking for a delivery that could help us earn some cash before the next race. Nice. Judging by this place, you used to race yourself. Oh, I sure did. Man, do I have some stories about the old days. <laughs> I bet. I have you know I used to run these streets. Oh, so you ran? On foot, I see. That's what street racing was like before the car was invented, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you worry about getting this team funded? All right, add a rear bumper. You know what? I'm going to keep it like this for now. Yeah, hey, that's a nice color right there. Ooh, that's a nice. I like that. I'm not really a big fan of green, but man, that is nice. Metallic. We've got carbon fiber. Damascus. Hmm. Satin metallic. Oh, that's cool. Oh, shit. I guess these are the ones that we own because of the palace, right? No, I'll go with this one just so you guys can see it. I mean, it's free. If it's for free, it's for me. Let's get it. So what is this? Week one. The qualifier Saturday. It's the big event Saturday night called the qualifier. Make sure you have enough cash and the right car to enter it. And the right car, huh? All right. So these are the cars that you need for the grand. The biggest racing event in Lake Shore. You'll need to collect a car for each of the tiers to compete. Make sure you're ready when the time comes. The weekly calendar displays how many sessions you have left before the qualifier and the events coming up. Okay. So we'll go Sunday here. Easy money. The challenge is reset. Deliver a car for Rydell. Place a side bets and break three billboards. All right. This is what I'm talking about. All right, we'll start off. We're all the way over here, so we're going to start off on this one. Yo, kid. Want to catch up about the scene? Is this going to be another one of those we did things differently when I used to race type of calls? Hey, back in the day, winning wasn't a be-all and end-all. So it is one of those calls. I used to race against this real loud mouth. Funny, I can relate. Whole race just wouldn't shut up. So one day, I throw down some stacks, called them out, told them let's race for more than just bragging rights. How about next month's rent? Oh, shit. Nah. What'd he do? Put his money where his trash talking mouth was. After that, side bets became the norm in the scene. Damn, Rydell. Remember, though, know your opponent. Don't be thinking you're better than you are. Fast way to lose a lot of money. Got it, Randell. Thanks, boss. Appreciate you. Good shit. Good tips. Let's see if we can do this. 
this. I don't think we good. Are we fast enough? So who do we have here? Our rivals. We've got Boost. A Boost uh, may seem standoffish, but he is in fact thoughtful and shy. Two things make him come alive: his passion for anime and racing, and the racing scene, where he feels at ease with himself, like he's from home. He wants to win, but community is more important. Okay. Ooh, ooh. All right. We'll read one of these each every time we play, or every time we do a race. We've got a couple of rivals here, but unfortunately for them, they're all going down. Damn it. Cannot start event. You have no vehicles at this tier. Oh, fuck. I was so caught up in the game and, like, just talking to you guys that I completely missed the fact that I was not able to approach that event. But that's fine, because now we've got one that we can. And we've got Obi, which we've, we've raced against him before. We've got a couple of cats. Uh, so we'll just go ahead and do this event. Ooh, so we can bet. Ooh. We can bet money. You predicted your position. No, man. I'm going to predict first place. Actually, you know what? Let's... Let's go for third. That's cool. You can bet money and shit. All right. Street race. I don't know if I'll be able to do this. I, I'm going to gauge the potential of this Mustang before I start betting that I'm going to win in first place. I highly doubt it. These cars look a lot more tricked out than I am. Oh my god. I just messed up the... Wow. Oh boy. Off to a bad start here. Oh, that guy... Both of them crashed. Looks like you want to win, huh? Okay, good. I just want to get third place, man. I don't want to lose my money. Okay, third place is right there. You gotta do these turns almost perfect in order to not lose your position. I do not need the cops on me. You regret that side bit? Oh boy, they got one under. Come on, we need to the hell's that about? Third place right there. I gotta beat him, I gotta beat him, I gotta beat him. Oh, there's a cop! Oh, I thought he was gonna crash! Final lap. Last and final lap. Control here and ready to assist. Oh, come on, this guy won't slow down. You should have been against someone else. I'm not trying to drift right now. Okay, and that's the first thing I do. What just happened? Did I get third? 
there. There's no way I get first. There's no fucking way. Anyway. I got fourth. Okay, I, okay, that, okay, we're good. Never mind. We're good. We're good. Okay. Not much gas left. Well, well, well. We got fresh eyes on that driver. Re-engaging. <laughs> Reckless behavior. Lost visual on the suspect. Good, they lost me. Get over to Underwood Gardens. That's where we lost the firm. Look out! Right, we have away. lost the popo. All right, so what do we got hey, here? If you're cruising around the lake, could you pick up a car for me? A Buick Grand National. They wanted to see how fast they can go with a real driver behind the wheel. You know any? Come wow, on, man. the Dadrick energy is real today. Drop me a pin. Sure. A pin. Right. Send me the location. <laughs> on it. And I'm pretty excited. The Regal from hell. Classic 80s muscle. My pop's dream car. He called it the Corvette Killer. So you better make him proud. No pressure. Corvette Killer, huh? I like that. Are we allowed to drive here? Yo! I'm gonna do a little digging about Yaz and the crew she's rolling with. I have a feeling she isn't the only one behind the grant. Really? Wow. Um, wow, I'm curious. What gave it away? The huge prize money? Maybe she's been giving rides to randos for cash in your car. Anywho, I'm craving boba. Peace! You're listening to News Across the Lake on KRS-FM, the number one station. Coming up, more from our exclusive interview with Mayor Stevenson. I want to assure the people of Lakeshore that their safety is my first priority. Now, I know the increased police presence is affecting the day-to-day -day in Lakeshore, but trust me, I hear you. We are in this together. Some people think you're too focused on crime and not enough on the problems of everyday people. I would say crime is a problem for everyday people, wouldn't you? Just answer the question, Mayor. All right. Here we go. Buick Grand National. Right now, rides. So, deliver the ride under two minutes, a thousand five hundred minimum. Minute, okay, I'll go for silver. A minute forty-five. Alright, Dell's rides. Oh, this is pretty fucking fast, man. What the hell? <laughs> Damn. Faster than my car. Crazy on the turning though. Huh? Man, the turning is rough. Got because of the road. Oh shit! Talk about adrenaline. For the love of God. These cars look so nice under the water, like in raining weather. My goodness. Don't miss, don't miss. Shit, we got gold. Nice. Under a minute 30. That's a pretty good car. A pretty fast car. Delivered. Safe and sound. Now that's how you drive. Customer so impressed, he said he would follow us on Insta. Do we have uh -huh. an Insta? <laughs> Is that the coffee machine? Didn't test that one off. Where? In the kitchen? No, no, no. No. It's a social media account. Oh, right. Uh -huh. That at Mr. Ride thing. Hold on. Look at him. There's a video of a dog skateboarding and people eating dumplings out of expensive sneakers. Okay, I'll figure it out. Uh, no, she, wait, hold on. She saw a dog skateboarding? 
not the point I was making. Later, kid. <laughs> Alright, so let me just make sure that I can go to this event. Because, um, oh yeah, this one we could. This one's locked, but these last two. Okay, yeah, we can do that. Uh-oh. Oh, that Pope almost saw me there. And drive nice. Oh, come on. Actually, if they're, if they're driving against me, I can just go really fast and then they'll, they'll lose me. Because they've got like a little a threshold, a little window. In which they can see if I'm an illegal street racer or not. Like right now. You see? slower because I'm a one uh one one heat like one star I guess if I've been if I've been doing races for longer and had more then probably they can detect you quicker who knows we'll find out anyways next event coming right up all right we've got a couple of new rivals we've got Del Rey the parents are both in the Navy while moving from base to base one constant was her camera Taking pictures helped her to develop a more creative and fluid side and a cool and calm presence. She has now brought this spirit to the hack. Up. Oh, she has now brought this spirit to the track. She's from North Korea. She is 29 years of age and she is about to get ah, fucking whooped. I'll go fourth place this time around, all right? Sweet. Right behind you, Del Rey. Put that phone down, girl. Oh my gosh. Get behind these guys. Get a little extra boost. Yeah, I gotta take these these shortcuts here, man. If I can manage to get this short look at that. Oh my god. Super clutch. And I'm still at third. This is cr oh, fifth. Excuse me. Man, this is wild. Yeah, it really does feel like drifting slows me down a lot. I take the shortcut again. I'm gonna take that position back. It's the only way. Well, I'm in the top three now, so. Oh, never mind. I hate this driver and I don't even know him. Fucking hell, man. You guys are really annoying. Shit. Now it's on. Said I'm pulling out the Buick. are like razor thin man it's a slight little upgrade slight we didn't really upgrade the car so if you place like below or above your your expectation you don't make your bet money is that what it is like if you if you place if you place better than it you don't make anything but if you place way below it, you make less or you lose it you made anything in that that race hold on there's something going on here Let's go back over here there's another race we can do oh this is the easy money that's right underground speed for speed underground Cool. What do we have here? Race through the sharp corners. All right, I'll go fifth here. Yeah, I don't. I, can, I can't trust my not not only but my my car but my driving skills at the moment. I can't trust them to go better under that or higher than that. Oh, 
So this is just a A to B, all right? This is not a, a lap sort of race, so we're good. Let's, let's go. I know they have a name. They had those names in, I remember in Underground, they had a name. I just forgot what they were called. Oh, shit. <laughs> Gotta tell me twice. Probably Hollow the Adventurous. I'm taking all the ramps possible. Gonna take more than that to stop me. <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. You're gonna have to get out the way right now. I'm just using you for boost. You know? <laughs> that just makes a little bit of nitrous never hurt nobody. Oh, there's another little bear there. I could have broken that one. That's it. I'm fully loaded. Maybe you think it's gonna help beat me. Try it. Oh, my God. Ooh, got skills, eh? Fuck. Look how fast these cars are, man. Or look how slow I am. Oh, you think you can beat me, don't you? That is an easy. Man, I, I, I slammed the brake there. I thought the turn was before. But it really was. This is just gonna make me try harder. Almost over the nine. The cops not slamming into me. Dispatch, patrol is here nice. leading okay, this chase. I think if I hold the, the brake for just a tad bit longer, then I can actually what do a better a better drift. Get each other up out here. Nah, bro, what the fuck? That side band is looking a little less strong. No! You freaking animal! I will not lose this damn perk. No! Almost over the nine. Bro, I was in position to. Patrol is leading this pursuit. This is bullshit. I can't believe that. I'm gonna leave it because it is what it is. I mean, I just. <sighs> My goodness. Southland Drive. Oh, there's no way in hell I'm letting this one get away from me. Come on! Oh my god. Oh, they shook us. Let's turn up the heat. That suspect just lost us at Douglas Park. I'll catch this jerk if it's the last thing I do here today. Call it a dispatch. Suspect's long gone. What a heat up, dude. What a freaking heat up. My goodness. Alright, hold on. Garage down below. Take the same little shortcut. Hopefully we're safe. <laughs> A little rough here. I think I have an off-road vehicle. Alright, perfect. I 
Dale's garage. Enter. All right, so we came back with 14K. Sweet. So we've got the Buick Today Grand National. Hall, Mayor Stevenson announced increased funding for the Lakeshore PD. Cars are causing havoc on our streets. After last night's high-speed antics endangering the good citizens of Lakeshore, I'm pushing my no-nonsense-for-nonsense policy mm -hmm. into action. Make sense? Nonsense. So this is... Oh, fuck. This is the one we just got, right? Yeah. I feel like the one we had, was, it's a little distracting. Some of the effects are a bit distracting when, you, when you're driving and stuff like that. Let me go to performance. Shit, okay. Um, this is the one I have now. Man, these things are so expensive. 109 what? Dude, let's do engine parts first. Hold on. Oof. Turbo. I mean, I kind of have to at this point. Fuck. Bro. Barely, man. Jesus Christ. I mean, we almost, we almost have it. We're almost at, at an A, so we're almost there. You can also upgrade the garage for better upgrades. Fuck. All right. Hey, Speedy. Hmm. Listen, I got some higher paying jobs if you're willing to get your hands dirty. Ooh, a little extra cash wouldn't hurt. But Rydell doesn't know won't hurt him, right? Because that worked out so well last time. Hmm? The garage got jacked. And now I'm trying to win my, my car back. Any of this ring a bell? Uh-huh. Ooh, ooh, don't forget my cut. I don't want to have to break your thumbs. <laughs> JK, blood makes me squeamish. Well, mm. I'm getting ramen and watching that new reality show where they put naked people on stage and make them sing for clothes. Season finale. <gasps> Maybe one of them will finally get socks. <laughs> See ya. All right. There's another little teddy bear back there. But we've got the race event, right? I want to get this money and uh, upgrade the car. Let's see what we get. See what happens. All right, let's just do it. Um. Yeah, predicted. That's that's fine. I guess based on my car, the game kind of predicts where I could place. Um, because before it wasn't in second. Now it's betting that I'm gonna finish second. So maybe that's some sort of automated system Sweet. 
I could have been in first place right now. I can still take your spot. Damn, dude. Honestly, I really could have. And I did. And I did. I did. <laughs> what just happened, bro? Oh my God. What just freaking happened? Whatever, I didn't make the, the money on the bet because I, I I was an overachiever as far as uh, placing goes. If I would have placed second, I would have made something, but... All right. Hey, kid. How'd it go out there today? Not bad. Tess seems to be honest, so that's something. Good to hear. Okay, listen. You know Jasmine is going to do anything it takes to win, right? Yeah, I kind of got that feeling. Okay, so make sure the car's performing. You gotta pimp it. Don't scrimp it. <laughs> pimp it, don't scrimp it. Pimp it, don't hmm. scrimp it. <laughs> yeah. You know, improve the performance of the car and earn some money. Oh, no, no, I get it. I just hadn't really heard that before. Good, right? I might stick it on a t-shirt. Anyway, see you back at the garage. Whatever you say, Rydell. I'll see the suspect. Give me the word and I'll engage. All right, so Man, you're putting my wallet at risk right now for chasing me. You know how hard I work for that three thousand dollars? Right, we gotta lose these cops. Dispatch patrol is on the scene and ready to help rid the streets of this park. Oh, crap. They shook us off. Nice. That suspect just lost us at Douglas Park. All right. We need to find this perp right freaking now. <laughs> suspect is long gone, Control. Come on. All right, good. Let me take a look at the uh, map here. Complete a long jump while in a heat two cop chase. All right, we can do this one. We could do these. Listen to Dip Ford's Late Lake on KRSFN, the number one station in the lake. That was KM with their new single, Tots Eclectic. Now I'm joined by Merrill Hopeful, Holden Parker the third. Welcome to the show. Thank you, Simon. Dip. Oh, no, thank you. Not with my cholesterol. <laughs> right. So let's start with the news that Mayor Stevenson's been handing out city contracts to her nearest and dearest friends. Has she? Well. Someone should speak out against that, huh? <laughs> yes. <clears throat> Someone who's running against her in the upcoming election? Well, yes. You should get them on the show, Simon. Dip. Dip. Oh, go on. I've got a box of crackers somewhere. <clears throat> Let's take some What calls. the hell? I need to find this fucking garage. This underground area, I can't seem to find it. There we go. Oh, that cop's above me. Should be safe here. Still trying to find his place and purpose in the world. After leaving Australia, he traveled to Tokyo and discovered street racing. He followed that passion to Lakeshore and his strong belief in the quality and community has won him many fans. He's only 19 years old. Shit. It's got, it's got it going on. All right, so. Let's go with this one first. 
Yeah. Let's do it. I, I, I still can't battle myself to win first place. Not, not, not yet. Can't do it. Not yet. I need to start on the green. I need to start on the green. Way better start. Ooh, baby, let's go. Look at that drift, though. Call me the corner king. Those billboards are, those are challenges, but I don't have, um... I don't have speed to get there before the the other racers at this moment. They're trying to take us all out. Hunting suspects. Oh shit! Well, this race is called Corner King for a reason. Like, oh my god! It's crazy how some minor changes just made this car so much better. Like, wow! Spoke too soon. Uh, yep, we had. <laughs> Sorry, pal. But not today. This is my block. I own the streets, sucker. myself more often now now i'm starting to build some confidence now, now i'm starting to build that confidence that i need that need for speed confidence oh yeah that's pretty good that was pretty good hmm so if I put the 1,500, do I lose money? Because I didn't place? That's crazy. Is that... Man, what the hell? But I'm good. I think I'm going to call it a night. I'm going to get this money back. Give this car some more upgrades. Into the garage. And that's all she wrote. Woo! With that heat... Multiplies. Oh my God, that was nice. So big shot, you find anything out about Jasmine and her crew? Not much, but may I just say, thank uh, you for calling me big shot. Mm. <laughs> Don't push it. All right. Sounds like Jasmine's running with the crew from Cyril Heights. They keep everything pretty low key. Mm. I just know they have big money. So we better be ready. The Heights, <laughs> Don't worry, the kid will be. Hmm. is good right here the exhaust is giving us some decent uh ooh, wow 173 so a dual turbocharger uses a small and big turbo to get better boost at low speeds due to its complexity maximum power is lower than using a single turbo okay that's pretty good and then we'll we'll do some more upgrades as as we go but this is our first car. This is officially our first car. We still have to upgrade the garage, get those things rolling so we could be able to upgrade uh, the car better with better parts and uh, obviously continue to to progress in this story and see what's going to go down with Jasmine and her crew now, which she's a traitor. But we're alive and we're we're back in the racing scene. So thank you guys for watching this episode of Need for Speed. If you guys enjoyed it, drop it a like. It means a lot. And stay tuned to the channel. We'll be back. I'll catch you on the next one.